this. Yep. Shouldn't be long. I see one of them on the power line. Just want to sit tight. Call softly. Mimic the hands. Got our decoys out. Let God do the rest.
it was a lot more patience than I had last year. I said, this year, I'm, I'm going to let him touch the decoy and play with it a little bit. Give us a little bit of a show. Get, learn some patience in a fun way. And that was a fun way to learn patience. <laughs> what I love about these reels. Look how pretty that fan is. That cream. Oh, I love them. I love these reels. They gobble a lot. And when you're having a tough time, if you go to Alabama or Louisiana or somewhere in the south and uh, you're getting whooped, come to Texas for a few days. It'll make you feel a lot better. It's been an awesome time, quick stop. We're actually on our way to another place and um, gonna try to get Willie his first bird. So we'll see if we can make that happen. Um, I don't know, I may have my hands full with him. And Langy's coming in and I, don't know, I guess Willie would call this an appetizer. So we got us an appetizer. Stopped here at Mr. Joey's place, quick hunt. We might get on one more before we leave, but we got to get on up the road, do some scouting. Hopefully get Willie a bird. All right, we're in the great state of Texas. A little different look than what I've been used to for the last few years. Uh, we've been hunting South Texas a lot, and we hunted South Texas earlier this week, but, uh, we're headed to Central Texas, the hill country. There we go. Thank you. So we're headed to the hill country of Texas. Man, I love it out here. Uh, a lot of cool terrain to work. These birds out here, Rio's just like what we got in South Texas, but uh, man, just being able to hunt them at different elevations and the terrain and just been, I mean, it, it, it reminds me of hunting up in the mountains and uh, out west of Nebraska and South Dakota and all that. So we're really excited. We're gonna be hunting with uh, somebody I've never hunted with before. Um, a guy named Austin. He's got a outfit called TNO Outfitters. Uh, never been there before. Don't know anything about it. Just he was recommended and I'm about to smoke a gobbler. <laughs> That's a good sign. <laughs> so we let him live another day, but we'll kill his buddy later, I guess.
think he's just shooting first. I'm playing. I'll back clean up. Ouch. Here we go, homie. Well done. Well done, senor. Hey, old boys. <laughs> oh. There you go. That just so happens we have a little something to celebrate. Man. Hmm. Thank you, Texas. Thank you, Texas. Let's just roost a bird while we smoke a cigar. Now, boys, we're enjoying a nice cigar. On a beautiful Texas evening. My boy Langy got it done and we're still whispering because the roost is about 400 yards from here and there were about five gobblers going down the creek to him. So I think we're going to take care of them tomorrow. But it's been a good day. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. That's some wood ducks. Like you, what do you got to say? Proof is in the bud. <laughs> oh, with Jason. Good things happen. Hey, bug commander, strike commander, strike again. Success. Gotta love it. We had luck at the other ranch too, so we, we made some good calls today. Hey dude. How'd it work out? Thank, thank you. Perfect? That was awesome. Yeah, man. That's what I like to hear. Good job, man. Thanks, man. Congrats. Thank you, man. Hey, Appreciate thanks for coming you. out. Yeah. yeah, thank you for having us. I, uh, I was hoping y'all got one because I went and checked out. Uh, this guy has about a thousand acres or so across the river, but you have to go all the way back through town to check it out. Yeah. I went over there to check it out and there was freaking birds everywhere. And I came back and right there at the uh, that old camp, yeah. there were two big old strutters. Oh, really? I sat there until dark right now and watched them strut watched them. All, all evening. I was like, gosh dang, I hope they there's, killed one because we could have killed one right here. About five more down there. Yeah. You think y'all got a good plan for in the morning or? I think so, like we were talking about, like, because we pretty much were just right at the bottom, like, with that. Did they come down that funnel, like I thought, or? They came, they came from. From your. They came from, from the river. The, from the hard left. Like like we from, thought they might okay. be on the other the side. West. They came from the west down the river. Perfect. And then came up and yeah. came right down, right Worked through the, the I mean, came crashing yeah, through yeah, the they brush. Came up, they came up to his call, and then they saw the decoys and walked from not much further than me to Jared, like, right next to us, and we let them get down to the decoys. Yeah. Awesome. <sighs> Love it. Yeah, there were two of them. Almost had, yeah, well, almost. that's good because it wasn't a big, big group of birds. Because there's a bunch of birds down there. Yeah, but uh, I've got. I mean, if y'all, if y'all like that deal down there, y'all can definitely hunt there. And I've got a good idea what we could do over here in the morning too.
we were literally about to leave the ranch and head home to our families. We were like, hey, let's just call right here. Of course, turkey sounds off, so. We're here, we might as well try them. He's about to fall in the river. Huh? He's about to fall in the river. Hey, look at the spurs on this guy. Look at that. Those Dagger. are some hooks. Dagger, son. Look at that. Look at that, Langy. Dude, you don't see many reels with hooks like that. Especially in the hill country. Mm-hmm. Good work. Good, Good night, man. Good shot. That's a hammer. You know, Jason got them to freaking cross, cross the river. Cross <laughs> the river. They crossed the river. Wow. That was awesome. A way to get around them and all that. You yeah. did it right. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Good shot. <laughs> I had a little, little sniper spot up on that hill. Man. What a fun trip. T.O. Outfitters, dude. That's right. Freaking Austin. Austin has got some unbelievable ground here. We've seen axes today. We've seen lots white, of turkeys. White heard tail. Lots of turkeys. White tail, everything. Beautiful a, ground, too. Yeah. Like, beautiful. Oh, you can't. Like, you dream of getting sh you know, river bottom, creek bottom, stuff like this. It's epic. Thank you, Lord. Absolutely. Absolutely. 
Well, I guess you can go home with some meat. We can go home and see our families after about a week. Mm -hmm. Mm. And you'll be right back after these. I'll be right back after them in Louisiana. <laughs> On the way out, boys. See y'all next time.